Right, a so scientific good. journal just published a brand new study showing findings from human fossil genomes that support the conclusion that Native Americans may have originated from China. Whoa. Oh, shit. Well, that's the... That's the theory, right? They came over the, the Bering, Bering Strait Strait from yeah. Russia, which is connected to China. But then, um, if it's ancient DNA too, like the current people in China today, which are like Han Chinese, mm -hmm. it's different. Cause like, there's been multiple waves of migration. So they could have originated there, and then uh, that could have been the first wave. And then the second wave might have came in, and then just wiped out the original Chinese people too. Mm -hmm. Cause yeah. that's happened multiple times in um, history. Yeah, I think that article, what they're doing is, you know how like anything Asian, they just say it's Chinese? Yeah. yeah. So like, because originally, uh, it's supposed to say Koreans that came over, because where, where those Indians are from, the Native Americans are from, is this area in Mongolia where Koreans also came from. So we're actually the original settlers. No, oh, okay. sorry. No way. Oh, no way. <laughs> Knew that. The um, Koreans. Yeah. Uh, what's your proof, dude? We have to. We have to. We have to I'm see this here, through. aren't I? <laughs> I've, okay. I have seen right, a lot of. Leave fossil. <laughs> I have seen a lot of Native American tribes where they bury cabbage in the ground and stuff. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen it. Fuck. <laughs> and then all the Indian casinos filled with Koreans. That's true. They're just trying to get with their roots. Yeah. I'm That's just, true. Just want to let you guys know. Don't don't let them bastardize our culture, guys. That's the Korean culture. Yeah, a lot of Indians doing this. Indian Native Americans. <laughs> yeah. and then, but and then, so so then so then now like what do we do with that info? Not to say that it's like this, but we're like what now? Now you got that. What do you do from there? What did people think before? I'll tell you what China will do. China will try to slowly overtake. America. Yeah, America. <laughs> oh. And it's already happening. Yeah, wanna, <laughs> it's going to be like, it's rightfully ours. Yeah. Go, now, us. Morongo is ours, Pachanga yeah. is ours, <laughs> San Manuel, yeah. Pala Casino. That's where they ours. start. Mm. It's going to be renamed Paching Chong. Paching <laughs> Chong. <laughs> Rightfully so. You want to go to Paching right. Chong yeah. Casino? I'm in. And then Sha Chink Redemption is going to have their premiere there. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> but you know, that's what China's doing with like um, Asia right the now. Chinese theater is just going to be a theater. It's going to be a theater, yeah. It's just the man theater. theater. It's just, yeah, just China, um, what they did is they justified taking over Tibet by saying, oh, they're Chinese. They're a part of us. Oh, that's what they did? That's yeah. crazy. Yeah. So then like anything they can do in history to be like, Oh yeah, that's supposed to be our land, like ancient oh, China. No, that would suck if they used right. this. Yeah. Holy Is shit! This Chinese propaganda, dude. No, the people that did this uh, study are not Chinese. Who, 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 can we can we, article, can we figure though. this out? A Chinese person. <laughs> <laughs> no, Jane Nam wrote the article. Oh, she's that's Korean. Nam is Korean. Or Vietnamese, yeah, right? Or Vietnamese oh, yeah. too. Yeah. But pretty much Chinese. Yeah, because they'll say, because you know, so China's, isn't that, aren't they doing that to your country? They're slowly taking over your Philippines? islands? Like one island by little. I mean, yeah. people take turns with Philippines. It's getting That's pretty true. tiresome. Everyone's kind of. Yeah, that is, Philippines is like me half Mexicans and half whatever was left over in Asia. Half <laughs> Mexicans? <laughs> I feel like that's what's happening on his head right now. It's like yeah, this yeah. this hairdo right here. <laughs> Half Mexican and then what else whatever else is going on. <laughs> Fiesta in the back. Yeah, <laughs> yeah oh. the Philippines, I don't know, that's that's complicated. The place that's that easily like taken over through the years is like, you know. Because you have so many islands, it's hard to control. I, mean, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what it is. So many of its own like indigenous people because of the oh, islands yeah. too, right? Different languages. Yeah. Yeah. Through so much fucking internal bullshit at yeah. the same time that you know, like. Is it Pacquiao y'all senator? Because <laughs> you play basketball. Well, he's arguably not a good politician either. I mean, like really that's not surprising. He's a boxer. He's like exactly. A boxer though. But like you know, like Philippines has had so much internal corruption that. And that's the best time to strike for anything yeah. exterior. I heard Duarte um, cut out a lot of that. Duterte? Duterte. 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 I don't know because uh, the torta? I always the torta? I thought that his war on drugs, which was basically you, you know, shoot anybody, kill anyone with drugs, like, you got a drug, fuck you. In my head, I was like, oh, that sounds kind of effective, but no, nah, they said people still fucking deal, use like it didn't really do the difference that he mm -hmm. says it did. Oh, of course, because newsflash, criminals never believe they're going to get caught. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it doesn't matter what the punishment is. Also, a lot of people that weren't doing drugs at all And they're dealing different. Killed. They're not sitting still anymore. They're kind of just like doing it. It's like, yeah, so if we're eighth, we got six bucks, we're here, and we can also do this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, hey, yeah, stay still, yeah. motherfucker. Find a <laughs> way. <laughs> yeah, it's like one of those things where, like, you know, the people just, uh, a lot of innocent people died, too. Oh, yeah. Because uh, the cops 
could uh, indiscriminately shoot people and they just be like, oh, that guy had drugs. Yeah. Mm. So, oh, but like, I don't like him. You know yeah, why? Because my dad is being yeah, used he, in he a way. Yeah, he fucked my wife. So I'm gonna kill him because he's a drug dealer. But again, I wasn't there. That's just the fucking news from my family and shit, but yeah. What I heard is that uh, people that were in real estate, like they, they enjoy that um, political party's reign because they make sure that the corruption was out of it and they, they're like, no one's gonna fuck with my house. Mm. Yeah. Apparently, I don't know, this is rumors, right? You know, like we go based off of rumors because we're human beings, but then like, um, when I think about countries that are like fucked up with corruption, I'm yeah. like, sometimes maybe they need a dictator. You know, you can't just, yeah. cause even like, <laughs> like maybe, you know, like, yeah. and then, and then maybe, we don't know. maybe yeah. once there's order and structure, then the dictator can go. Yeah. Like someone's got to establish that kind of like everybody's following the rules and then yeah. they can have a democracy. Yeah. It's a little bit dicey too because like what country isn't corrupt but there's levels of corruption that are still somewhat beneficial to the country in an illusionary way and then there's yeah. some that are just totally tanking the country. Like, a solid true. dictator would be uh, Nick Cannon. Yeah. <laughs> I was trying to find bitch. a way to get him back in. Yeah, Nick Tater. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> He's really big on branding. He's always gonna add Nick or Incredible to his stuff. You know what I'm saying? I wanna see a rap battle go down when they have disputes and shit. You know, like a roast battle. Yeah. You know, Tim Delaghetto's the fucking judge and shit. Like, Sam. Let's make this country <laughs> incredible again. Yeah, so, because sometimes the criminal about. element does help. You know, like La original Las Vegas, mm. total criminal element. You had two ninety nine, three ninety nine prime rib dinners. Yep, I fire. Like that. Now the corporations took over. You have you know thirty ninety nine prime rib dinners. Don't you know, like and no yeah. free parking. No. no free parking. No free parking. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah. So I don't know if this study necessarily is gonna really change anything other than. You know, what? Get a bunch of people going, that ain't true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know someone in China's like, dude, let's just take America. I know. That was our time. I mean, they're already yeah, yeah. kind of in the process. Right. They're doing it. For We're sure. in the red. <laughs> they're going to take Alaska over first. Because it's closer. Mm. But again, mm. I mean, China, China's activity with how much of America they're taking over, again, you can't really be that mad at China because they can't buy nothing that ain't for sale. That's true. But, but true. you know, when I think about Native Americans and who they might look like the most, I would say Cambodian. <laughs> There's a pageant. Yeah. I, I would say, like, <laughs> who looks the most Chippewa? Yeah. Chippewa. Like, it's Cambodian. You know what I mean? Right. Like, get a Cherokee man or a Chumash man, you know? And then what does he look like the most to you? And I'm like, maybe a Cambodian guy? Love but not the Chinese guy. Cambodian guy, you know what I mean? About, didn't one of you guys say there was like a thing where there was like a Mongolian traditional? Oh yeah, I watched the uh, and then Native American next show. Yeah, it was a uh, it was like a throat singing collaboration. It was a Mongolian throat singer and a Native American one. And then when they stood next to each other, I'm like, man, I can't even tell which one's Asian, yeah, and which yeah, one's yeah. Native American. They literally look exactly the same. Might be Word. Mongolian. Yeah. Sure. You, you mean Korean. Guys, okay, come on. It's, it's Korean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to sell that. I don't know why you guys keep changing this ambassador. They weren't wearing makeup, though. Oh, okay. That's different. <laughs> do you really... North Korean, guys. Uh, do, you, do you agree that Koreans are the number one Asian in all the planet? Um, in all the planet, as opposed to, like, half the, the planet? Yeah. Or, um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, for me, Asians, there's big three. It's the big three. <laughs> and no, everyone, no one matters. It's Chinese, Japanese, Korean. Like, I mean, because... But who's number one out of the three? Like, clearly Korean. <laughs> Alright, state your case. At, at home, at home. State your case. At, at your guys' home, what, what kind of TVs do you guys have hanging on your walls? Chinese TVs. You have Chinese? <laughs> clearly no one watches TV at your house. This TV's broken. Your, your, TV's, your, your TV's this thick. It's like this thick. <laughs> the screen's a triangle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Turns on half the time. <laughs> That's the thing that supports it, just your TV brand. Oh, no, no. Also, uh, will you wash your clothes? Uh -huh. uh, you know, um, uh, number one. I got an LG washer. There you go. Number one boy group in the world, BTS. BTS. Number one girl group in the world, uh, Blackpink. Mm. Okay. Blackpink is the number most subscribed to uh, account on YouTube. Yeah, they they the beat Justin groups. Bieber. Wow. You guys do have the best groups yes. by far. Yeah. You're, you're, you're winning the silver. Continue. Okay. Um, Walter Hong. <laughs> oh. The God. The God. Yeah. Uh, you know. And let, let's see. Oh, um, 
I don't know. Barbecue. Could we barbecue? Can't fuck with that. That, that is unanimously great. liked. That is a great Did you miss experience. that when you moved back to oh, Houston? Yeah. Oh. Have you met anybody that doesn't like Korean barbecue? You need to kill them. You need to yeah. spit, you need to spit on their face, right? Uh, yeah. Vegans, maybe? Even if you oh, yeah. even if you think of the idea where you're like, I gotta cook my own food? What? Yeah. You're like, no, no, no. It's not even like that. No. Yeah. 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 You know what's crazy is like, so I was looking, I just went down this rabbit hole of like how much each country in Asia their population and all that, right? So Korea, a third of their population of ethnically Koreans are actually outside of Korea. Yeah. Like US, Australia, Canada, whatever. Oh. That's a ton, right? And then the population in South Korea is actually pretty small compared to all the other nations and how much noise they can make for such a small group, right? Yeah. Because I was like looking at Southeast Asia and Vietnam has like double or more population and I'm like, how is that even possible? They're probably lazy or something. Maybe Vietnamese <laughs> pop more kids out. I don't know. Like, but it's also called they call it Korean diaspora, which is like they spread everyone out. Like, so oh, like globally, yeah, there's yeah. there's no country in the world where you won't find I a Korean Koreans people. Koreans are really really good at like keeping everything in the community and growing like financially because they're like awesome. Jewish. Yeah, mm. they're really fucking good at that, man. Like, dude. They're like alcoholic well Jewish. All right, yeah, this, there might be some, uh, yeah, you know, yeah. some water to your theory, dude. I think this might be true. How do you feel about that, Bart? Well, I was thinking, you know, like uh, Chappelle, he has that one bit, right? It was like on an airplane, and then it was about to go down, and then it was him, and then the other black person was from Africa, mm -hmm. and even though they're not like of the same, but he could like my brother, right? Yeah. I feel like for Koreans, if they notice another Korean, they also have the for Chinese people. It's just like, are you Chinese? Or are you cool? <laughs> yeah. like, shit over there. Dude, yeah. KP, dude, yeah. KP is real. Koreans also have the like, oh, I'm yeah. Korean, you're Korean. Yeah. Instant yeah. connection. Dude. You know who has that who has that heavy <laughs> Puerto Ricans, yo. Oh yeah. yeah. So Same heavy. thing. Puerto Ricans, when you see the flag, it's the the flag you it's one of those like you show up where the flag is, you know what I mean? Like I, I as a as a Puerto Rican I got it. Oh. Wow. It's just one of those things you just have to have, and they're just like, oh, Boricua, tu eres Boricua, ah, and it's, the, it's, the, thing, it's the whole situation. Same thing with Dominicans, it's like, oh, I'm Dominican, I go, me too. Yeah, You just flip that. You got a Dominican, you get the Puerto Rican and Dominican card. It's the best conversation, it's a wallet too, look, fwa. <laughs> you know what I mean? So it's a cool little conversation starter, but yeah, it was crazy that they, they all beef with each other, like, uh, and Mexicans too, because I'm, I'm all three. Puerto Rican, Dominican, and Mexican. And so they, if there's oh. a grand war, which one do you side with? Oh shit, man. Oh. Mexico. Yeah, the ultimate. I'm not even Mexico, and I side with Mexico. I'm more Mexican than than than, than Puerto Rican, Dominican. Cause my mom's full Mexican. Uh, my dad is half Puerto Rican, Dominican. And culturally, so you were raised just... with Mexican, like. Culturally, I was actually raised uh, on the Puerto Rican side. My, mm, my grandma, yeah, that's okay. where my family. My grandfather's uh, Dominican, um, but heavily on the Puerto Rican side for sure. So you just eat bananas for no reason and shit. Huh? <laughs> bananas, bananas and everything. No eat bananas for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> Not even the rice. Just give me a plate of bananas. Dude. Yeah, hell yeah, yo. We mash them, we fry them. You know what I'm saying? Oh, Bake them. Yeah, yeah, no Delicious. doubt. Delicious.